What's up, y'all? So they had the memorial for Nipsey yesterday. Oh, I pee, homie. So let you know in life, G. You can't trust nobody. You can't take life for granted. Which I don't believe he did. You can't take life for granted and be a family man, have kids, and doing everything for your community. You know what I'm saying? Feel me? Listening to this, uh, uh, excuse me. No, I'm from Fort Worth, Texas, so I'm listening to this, uh, listening to this, uh, Mo 3, Mo 3 out of Dallas. I just turned on this, uh, Nipsey Hustle, right hand of God, you know what I'm saying? Um, his death didn't go in vain, though, you hear me? I'm gonna tell you why. Because he left something to his girl to his kids, to his community, you know what I'm saying? Sometimes we don't know when somebody died. And we don't know. Yeah. Yeah. Come on. Yeah. You hear what this nigga saying? Man, hold on. I tripped out. Let me put that back on. This is what he say. know this one thing y'all we all gonna have that time when we gonna go we all gonna die one day but see that's why you gotta do everything you can while you're here everything you can while you're living it's not just about Nipsey it's about everybody that died before us and everybody's gonna die after us and the fact that we gonna meet that day too come on and you gonna we all gonna meet that fate. That's where we at, man. It's the world we live in. I saw the memorial they had for him yesterday, man. A lot of the great things people had to say about him. But check again, like I said. You hear him? Come on. Yo. We all gonna meet that day. Your life will not go in vain if you do something with it. Live today like you're gonna die tomorrow. That means you'll try to accomplish something. Leave something to your kids. Leave something to your wife. Leave something to your husband. Leave something to your mom and daddy. Leave something to the world. Leave something to the community. Leave a message, man. Because the person's body might die, but their soul forever live on. But they, but they, but but they message will live on. What they did for they for for, for their people in the community will live on. We forget about that. He gone now. It's like everybody else gone. Like one day you'll be gone. We chase too many of the wrong things in this world. You want to chase the money before chasing the passion and the dream and the understanding of who you are first. Now it don't work like that. You put in the hard work and the money will come later. You understand me? When you get that money, look at it like it's not yours. Because God bless you with it. So you bless others with it. And you keep receiving blessings. It's better to give than to receive. Because when you're giving, you are receiving. You understand me? When you're giving, you are receiving. I understand. I almost lost my life a few times over some nonsense. Because me choosing to be a certain way or acting a certain way. like that. You gotta ask yourself every day, 
What are you here for? What are you living for? You gotta check yourself, man. Analyze yourself. Check yourself. Look at yourself in the mirror every day and see what you can do to change and get better. Like I said, live like it's your last day. Spread positivity to this world, to your children, to your spouse, to your family. You hear me? God will bless you, homie. R.I.P. to Nipsey. R.I.P. to everybody before him. Everybody after him. But most importantly, let's get our life together. Let's use the people that pass away as motivation to get our life together. To change other people's lives. To change our life. Feel me? Because you don't know when your day is. It's one thing you can't calculate. It's one thing guaranteeing this earth. It's your, it's your interest in this earth and your exit out of there. Live accordingly. 100.